Hi, I'm Greg Dell, and today I'm here with attorney Stephen Jessup. How are you, Stephen? Good, Greg. Yourself? Good. And today we're going to talk about the Jackson National Life Insurance Company, which is a company, as you know, Steve, that's been around since the 1960s, but recently kind of got themselves into the disability insurance market through their acquisition of the Reassure America policies and some other disability insurance companies. Now, you know there's been tons of consolidation in the disability insurance industry where one pot, one company is gobbling up another company and then we end up dealing with a new company. So really up until 2012, that was when Jackson first came into the picture with us, which we always knew is Reassure. So can you just talk for a minute what your experience has been like with Jackson and what a claimant should expect if they have a policy with Jackson? You know, honestly, I think the biggest surprise to some of the clients was I had got a letter in the mail today and it says Jackson, on it. who are these people? So is the explanation of it. Um, but I would have to say of, of the acquisitions and someone taking over a claim, it seems to be one of the more uh, seamless ones. Uh, I think they, they've kind of picked up where Reassure was uh, with the claims handling. So I, I, you're seeing the same level of inquiries, requests for information, things along that line. Um, it seems that they are newer, you know, when you look at information on Jackson, they haven't been in the long-term disability, you know, arena for all that long. So I, I think they're, you know, cutting their teeth in it themselves. Um, but I, I think you would expect the same that you would get from any of your Reassure America or what you would have expected from your claims person before that. I know some people think, oh my God, is my insurance company going out of business? Am I not going to have a benefit? It was just an acquisition, so there's there's nothing of concern with that. Right, it was a healthy acquisition, mm -hmm. and and for the most part, and you can look at our we have other videos on Reassure, and there's not a lot of litigation with Reassure, mm -hmm. and Reassure generally tries to do the right thing on a disability claim. I find them to be very detailed and thorough in what they do, but assuming that Jackson took over all of the Reassure people, it should still continue to be business as usual, mm -hmm. at least for Jackson policyholders, and also from our end because. Everything we knew about Reassure, we still know about Jackson. And over the last couple of years that we've been doing the Jackson claims, I haven't seen any changes and I'm still dealing with the same people at the company. How about you? The same people. There hasn't been you know, any changes in claim. People looks like they just kept the staff, just basically changed the uh, stationary. Uh, the interesting thing to, we'll see is that they, they are in the uh, group disability market. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see once, you know, maybe more of those policies start popping up or more uh, companies start going to them. Right. And maybe they'll have some more volume mm -hmm. in what they're doing, but they're not one of the bigger companies. And I think they do everything out of Michigan for the most part. Correct. They're headquartered in Michigan, have offices uh, throughout the country, and I believe they're in 49 states as well. So selling policies. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you have a policy with Jackson, no matter what stage you're at, thinking of filing, you've been denied, or you need help dealing with the claim with them on a monthly basis, Feel free to call any of our attorneys and we'll let you know right away through a free consultation whether or not we can assist you.